Uh, this video is a continuation of our uh, video which uh, was entitled uh, part 2 of integration by parts where we started looking at uh, integrals of uh, this form which we called type 1 um, where you got a polynomial times either an exponential, a sine or a cosine so um, in uh, <clears throat> Part two, we showed how to work out uh, A and uh, B. Uh, in uh, this video, we're going to start with uh, D, and uh, then we're going to give you a chance to have a go at uh, C before we demonstrate how to work it out. Okay, so in D, we have got uh, the integral of x squared cosine of uh, 0 0.2x dx um, <clears throat> so in this case the polynomial is uh, x squared so u we're going to let to be x squared and so du is going to be 2x dx then dv is going to be the rest of the integral which is going to be cosine 0.2x dx so cosine 0.2x dx <clears throat> then v is going to be the integral of this so integrate both sides uh, then integral of dv is just v integral of cosine is sine so we're going to have uh, sine 0.2x and then we're going to have to divide by the derivative of this uh, derivative of this is 0.2 when we divide by 0 0.2 it's the same as multiplying by 5. so what we're going to have now is uh, if we call this thing i so i is going to be uv <coughs> minus integral of v du uh, uv is going to be 5x squared sine 0.2x so it's going to be this term times this term minus the integral of v du so we're going to have 5 sine 0.2x, that's v du is 2x dx. Okay, so if we uh, tidy this up, so it's going to be 5x squared sine 0.2x minus 2 times 5 here. It's going to give us 10 x sine 0 0.2. And then we have got a polynomial of degree 1 times sine. So we're going to apply parts again uh, to that integral. Okay. So our polynomial this time is x. So we let u be x. So du is going to be dx. Then dv is going to be sine of 0.2x dx. Then v is going to be the integral of that. So it's going to be negative cosine. 0.2x then we're going to have to divide by 0.2 so that's the same as multiplying by 5 okay so what we're going to have now so if we go back to i so i is going to be equal to um, 5x squared um, sine 0.2x 
then this is going to be minus 10 times Then I'm going to have uv minus integral of v du again. Um, so this is going to be 5x squared sine 0.2x minus, let's uh, write it here. So uv this time, there is v, there is u. It's going to be negative 5x times cosine 0.2x. Then minus integral of v is negative 5 cosine 0 0.2x. Uh, du is just dx. Okay. So this is going to be 5x squared sine 0 0.2x minus. Uh, 10 into negative 5x cosine 0.2x then um, minus and minus here is going to give us plus so we're going to have plus 5 into cosine 0.2x dx and then now that the the trigonometric function is multiplied by a constant we can simply integrate here. So that means we are right at the conclusion of our integration. So this is going to be minus 10 into minus 5x cosine 0.2x. Then integral of cosine it's just going to be sine here. Um, however, if we multiply by 5 again, so this is now going to be uh, 25. And then, of course, plus C. Uh, then we're just going to remove the brackets, collect terms, and that's going to be that. So we're going to have sine 0.2x minus, um, we're going to have two minuses here, this minus, minus, so the term is going to be plus, and uh, it's going to be 50x cosine 0.2x, and then the next term is going to be minus, it's going to be 25 times 10 is going to be 250, 0.2x plus c. Uh, then we're going to bring the sine terms together and the only one cosine term is going to be on its own. 250 uh, times sine 0.2x then this is going to be plus uh, 50x cosine 0.2x then plus c and uh, this is uh, our final expression right so at this point um <clears throat> we're going to give you an opportunity to have a go at uh, c uh, so, so integrate this uh, you can pause the video and then when you continue it uh, you'll be able to compare with our solution all right um we're now going to scroll down to our solution of uh, part uh, c um we do hope that uh, you are finding this video useful uh, we will appreciate your support by uh, subscribing um, and uh, liking the video all right so in uh, part uh, c um, our polynomial is uh, x, so we're going to let u be equal to x here. So du is going to be dx. Um, so dv is going to be the rest uh, of the integral. Um, so it's going to be sine 2x dx. 
So V is going to be negative cosine 2x. And then we're going to have to divide by 2 because that's the derivative of this. Uh, a good practice here uh, is uh, if you're not sure whether this sign is good, uh, is to always uh, see that when you differentiate this, it gives you that. So we know that uh, derivative of cosine is negative sine and then times 2. So it's going to give us that. So that is good. So then we plug it into the integration by parts formula. So we're going to have uh, V times uh, U. So we're going to have negative X over 2 times cosine minus V du. This is V. That, that is du. And then minus and minus becomes plus here. And so this now we can integrate straight away. It becomes 1 half of sine 2X. So this becomes 1 over 4. And uh, that is uh, the final expression. All right. Thank you.